Okay, we've been talking about the New York City School for the Performing Arts, which you will see in this movie, Fame. And we talked about Denise, and she has a special problem here. She wants to be a singer, but her parents want her to be a pianist, and she has to decide whether she's going to please her parents or please herself. Well, we're also going to talk now about another student whose name is Jenny, okay? And Jenny has a different sort of problem. When she went to her old school, she was the best actress in her school. <laughs> An actress, of course, is a woman who acts. If it's a man who acts in a movie, he's an actor. That's true. Well, even though she was the best at her old school, now she's at a school where everyone's talented. So that doesn't really mean anything. Everyone's good at this new high school. Now, if you're talented, it means you were born with a natural ability to do something pretty well. Maybe your talent is in sports, maybe your talent is in music, or maybe you're an excellent uh, student with math. Who knows? People have talents in a lot of different areas. Some people are really good at making friends. That's a talent, too. So don't forget there are lots of kinds of talents. Well, Jenny's not really sure if she can rise above her classmates. Now, this just means that she can become as good as or even better than her classmates. To rise above means you become better and better and better, or you stand out. So people notice that your talent is actually bigger than those around you. Mm -hmm. That must be hard for young people if they're used to being number one in their school yeah. and then they go to a new school and they're just nothing. They're like the same as everybody else. It's probably very difficult to deal with a situation like that. Uh -huh. So that is Jenny's particular problem. She wants to rise above her classmates or at least be as good as they are. Well, let's talk about another student at this high school, Malik here. And Malik is a great actor too, but he's got a different sort of problem. So again, we're talking about performing arts here, which have to do with acting or dancing. And in this case, Malik is a good actor, but well, his problem is different. His problem has to do with money. Mm, yeah, it says he comes from a poor background. This just means this is how he grew up. His parents are poor. They probably didn't have a very nice home. Uh, who knows? Maybe he only had one parent. Maybe his father had died or maybe his mother had passed away already. We don't know, but he didn't have a lot of money. They were poor. So you could say he comes from a poor background. Now, he doesn't know if he's going to be able to pay for the school fees. School fees here just means the tuition that you pay, the money you pay, in order to attend school there. And mm -hmm. it's expensive to go to school there. Mm -hmm. But he might get a scholarship or something like that to help pay those fees. Mm -hmm. Okay, so he's got that problem because of his poor background. Well, this October on a movie screen near you or in a movie theater near you, mm -hmm. you might be able to see this movie and you'll be able to find out if these students are able to work hard and if they can work with their passion mm -hmm. and have that hard work and passion that it takes to get to the top. Now, passion is just a very strong feeling you have toward something or someone. Uh, passion, to have a passion for or to have a passion. Uh, I guess your passion is sports, right? You like passion. sports. Passion. Oh, well, I have a passion for sports, but music, it can be anything. You can also feel great passion for someone. So you really love them. But here we're talking about a passion for a hobby that you have, a strong love for it. You just can't do it enough. Passion, here's our word power word. Let's take a closer look. Word Power Hi everyone and welcome to Word Power. Today we're going to talk about the word passion. The movie Fame 
shows that you need hard work and passion to become famous. Passion is a noun that means a strong belief or feeling in something or someone. For instance, protecting the environment is something Craig has a lot of passion for. It can also mean a very strong liking for something or somebody. For example, Leo has a great passion for art, so he paints every day. Passionate is the adjective form of passion. We often say that we are passionate about something. For example, Melissa is passionate about music and hopes to be in a band someday. That's all the time we have for word power. Thanks for listening. Okay, so you might have love for somebody, or heat for somebody, or passion, and here they have passion for the things they love to yeah. do. And you'll laugh and you'll cry when you watch this movie as you follow the lives of these young people in this high school, and maybe their life story will be kind of similar to yours. Yeah. Well, check out this movie in a theater when it comes. It's time now to listen to our Chinese teacher, and then we will be back to chat.